Hey guys, today in this new section we are going to see how to simulate Arduino in Proteus for analog read serial. That is we are going to read analog value from a potentiometer. Okay, so let's open Arduino, Arduino ID. We have it on our example file, examples, basics and you can see here analog read serial. Okay, just open it. Now I am just removing the comments. Okay, in the setup part, you can see here uh, that is initialized a serial communication. Okay, actually it is UART and 9600 is the baud rate at this bit per second. Okay, when coming down, you can see another function that is void loop. Actually, this is an infinite loop like while or uh, true. Okay, so inside that you can see a variable that is sensor value and integer variable and the value is from analog read function. Okay, analog read A0. A0 means our pin. Uh, it is an analog pin on Arduino. Actually, our Arduino got 10 bit ADC and it can read a value from 0 to 1023. Uh, it will plot the uh, values from 0 to 1023. And you can see here serial uh, dot print and sensor value. That means it is, uh, it is just uh, printing to our serial monitor. Okay, here we got our serial monitor. And when we simulate it on Proteus, we want we have our terminal. Okay, terminal emulator. Okay, let's see how it will work. I'm just compiling it. Yeah, we got our hex file here. Dot hex file. We will come into it later. Now I am going to open my art our Proteus. Okay, Proteus 8 professional. Your version may be uh, differ. Okay, new project. And I'm just giving a name here that is like uh, serial, right? So I'm just giving serial analog, okay, analog serial. Okay, anyway, then just give you a path. I'm just saving it to my desktop. Okay, and next uh, landscape A4, uh, just uh, set your layout or template. I'm just choosing this landscape A4. Next, okay, do not create a PCB layout no firmware project finish okay now pick your device i'm just selecting arduino um, uno okay yeah arduino uno and we go and also we need potentiometer port okay potential oh, port hg okay this potentiometer we can change the value and another thing we need is yeah, that's all we need okay now i am just taking my arduino and placing it on a sheet okay then potentiometer actually we want to connect it to a zero pin okay in our sketch you can see here yeah uh, in the sensor value equal to analog read a zero that means it is getting value from a zero pin okay so yeah i have connected it to a zero and uh, for changing the value we need a uh, voltage okay it's a potential difference we want to create so uh, i'm just powering it up okay just giving the power and uh, ground okay then only it will be equal right power i'm just giving plus 5 volt 5 volt okay I'm just uh, just given a voltage there 5 volt okay now just go to uh, instruments and take virtual terminal okay and place it over here and yeah transmission pin of our Arduino should connect to receiving pin of our terminal and receiving pin to transmission pin okay uh, that is because UART okay we are using UART circuit here and crystal okay our frequency of our crystal is 60 megahertz and program okay program i am just giving the link to my pro, uh, the address to my program means our dot hex file okay yeah it will be here ah dot hex okay we want to give the path okay in the proteus to that file created okay it's uh, pasting it here and click on okay now just click on the simulate button 
you can see here it is showing 5 toll okay 15 percent percentage showing 5 toll yeah 1023 you can see here the maximum resolution is 1023 because our Arduino is uh, 10 bit ADC our Arduino has 10 bit ADC that is why it is showing 1023 and if you are using a microcontroller with 8 bit ADC it will show 255 okay uh, you can see the changes here okay zero now it's zero and to maximum one zero two three and guys if you need to see it in voltage then there is another way okay uh, just open the sketch file examples basics and read analog voltage okay here yeah here you can see 5.0 this is our reference voltage because here we had given 5 voltage okay 5 voltage reference as a reference voltage you will get mm, yeah that is divided by 1023 our resolution okay maximum resolution and, uh, then we will get the voltage okay current voltage I'm just removing this and comparing this sorry okay let's comparing this okay now I'm copying the path of this hex file okay I'm pasting it here okay now we're simulating it you can say it is showing 5 that is 5 volt now you can use this as a voltmeter okay you can see yeah now it's 3.2.70 2.50 yeah to minimum 0 volt okay you can see here a maximum 5 volt we want to get okay yeah we got 5 volt eh? 50 percentage yeah 2.50 okay guys i hope you enjoyed this session if so please like this video and consider subscribing my channel you can see in another video till then bye